Click, click. What? I what? got a shotgun. Click, click. Your shotgun goes click, click? It's a talking shotgun. Talking shotgun? It's me, man. Let me in. It's freezing out here. Ooh, me who, man? I'm gonna cut dude, you. Dude, 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 Matson, it's me. It's, it's me, Chris. Fuck, I didn't recognize you with those new glasses. Oh, shit, hold on. Where are you going? Yeah, I just... There are fucking... There are fucking eyes everywhere. Come on, get in, get in, get in, get in. What's with the hat, dude? You look like Relic from the Beach Comb. Relic from the Beach Comb. Oh, oh, my God. God. Relic from... Happy now? This is a nice setup you got here. Well, it's homey, that's for sure. Yeah. But I thought, with all the weirdness that's going on, I just need to stay off the grid for a while. No, that's understandable. You know, even with a scarf, I should really invest in buying a hat of some kind. Your tea careful it's hot. But uh, not, not like uh, that hat. Well, you know, you didn't like my, you didn't like my toque, so I thought. No, I think the toque was actually a little bit better than that. Um, can I ask you? And something? who may for me? And just in case you're not who you say you are. I have a pepper shaker with your name on it. I'm just going to leave this here. Right. Well, dude, believe me, it's me. Ah. I mean, I don't know if you notice, but that thing is still there. No, it's gone. It's now jumped to my nose. <laughs> you have it on your nose now? I have it on my nose. I've had it for a month on my nose ever since those bastards hauled me out of my fucking living room. Yeah. How long have you been here? <sighs> What's the date? Uh, I don't know. The new year? 2013. Oh, Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Wow, I thought it was still December. Yeah. I'd probably been here about four weeks, five weeks. Four. Five I spent weeks. about a week in detention before they shipped me back. Oh, yeah? And then uh, babbling to myself in a cell. And, yeah. Wow. Yeah, man, you really freaked us out when you uh, sort of... Uh, went to check that door and then I didn't uh, I didn't hear back from you I tried calling everybody well I'm sorry I knew where I'm, I'm sorry I didn't pick up but I was uh, I was in the process of being detained yeah for uh, I think it was illegal torrent downloads I think that was the pretext really anyway I between between the fists and the uh, the fast Japanese I didn't really catch much of it and I guess deportation was the best option yeah that are a Japanese prison, which are not fun. Uh, so you've been here for how long? Sitting in front of these two cameras for about four weeks. Four weeks. Wow. Well, no, I didn't set up the cameras for a couple of weeks. I got bored though. So you were just dude. Like, no internet. Yourself? The only newspapers I have are the ones I use over there to light the fire, and they're about six, seven months. They're about, they're almost a year out of date because that's the last time anyone was here, and. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, hey, actually, if you want to monitor the sound, you can put on those headphones. They work really well. Oh, yeah? You yeah. Know, you got them all hooked up? All hooked up. I was getting bored, I was, so I started recording conversations with myself. Hello, hello. I was, talking, I was talking to myself anyway, so I figured, well, you know, might as well really do it. Oh, yeah? No, it's, but, a, uh, it's, a, it's got a little hum in there, but I think I can take that out. But you'll, you, you'll, yeah, yeah anyway, you'll never see those conversations. We're taping over them now. Oh, yeah? You yeah, I was, I was sitting down to do another one when you showed up. So you actually were using analog tapes. This one. That one. Yeah. That one's analog. Wow. Yeah, I Hi, seen mom. <laughs> well, I guess we're, yeah, but it's got to stay analog for now because we're. Man, I'm getting homesick. Dude, I got something for you. Don't ask me where I got it from. Is it a box of cookies? No, open it up. A USB stick and a SIM card, just what I always wanted. They're a little bit more advanced than that, but uh, they're used the same way. I would uh, suggest plugging in that USB. Do you have a laptop? Oh, uh, yeah. I got an old one sitting in the other room. Uh, check your email, and then uh, uh, there'll, be t there'll be a ticket waiting for you to take you back to Japan. Where'd this come from? To be honest with you, I can't tell you, but 
just don't worry everything's been taken care of it's gonna happen so you'll be able to go back to japan well that's a relief that's a relief yeah so uh so no more attacking people with sauce it's all I had at hand. I, no one comes to the door here. I haven't had any, like the whole time I have been here, there's How no one here. How did you find this place? This is, well, that's an interesting story. Remember when we were rich for about 15 minutes? Yeah, when we did that. Uh, we that were little... so, yeah, so we were like, I mean, what was it? I, I was worth, we were each worth about 12 billion. Yeah. Yeah. Well, you know, you, you, we didn't know that it was only going to be 15 minutes and you went on Amazon and just bought some stuff. Yeah. I kind of made a few serious investments during that 15 minutes. All I bought was was just uh, Star Wars action figures. Yeah, I got this cabin, this house, this house. I bought this house. This house, yeah. And um, I invested. See, you're wondering because I'm living off the grid, right? But I've got electricity. Yeah, how's that even possible? Well, see, that's the other thing. So the house was nothing, okay. right? That was that was done. That was quick. Yeah. Um, but the the tricky part was actually uh, I invested in a company that makes uh, mini lifters. Mini lifters? Yeah. La, what's it? Liquid liquid fluoride thorium reactors. And what? so I, I, did, I gave them a whole chunk of seed money and they were so grateful that I managed to talk them into burying one just outside. What? So essentially I have electrical power in this house. And it's buried with a lead and concrete lining so you can't detect it from satellite. Are you serious? Yeah. Um, so, because if I was on the grid, she'd she'd figure out I was here. Wow. Yeah, I um, I'm speechless. I really don't know. What to say. I'm just more resourceful. This isn't than you nuclear, are. is this? Yeah. So everything that you're running in this cabin is is running off nuclear power. Well, that, that's running off of wood. Well, obviously, yeah. But uh, I mean, technically, it's nuclear, I guess, because it's all powered originally by the sun. But mm. well, fire. yeah. Um, Actually, right now we're running off a of battery because the problem with uh, it's it, the problem with the reactor is that it actually generates too much power, mm -hmm. and if I'm not in the grid, I can't. I, what I used to do is I used to be able to bump it back into the neighborhood. And so there's some people there who think their their solar panels work really well even at night, <laughs> uh, but recently I haven't I haven't been able to do that. So what I have to do is I have to I turn it on. I've got these I've got these big banks of batteries that I had installed with it. Mm -hmm. I, I, I turn it on for basically just enough time to get it running okay. and it charges those batteries and I turn it off and so I have I have electrical but so all this is just I use I had to use or... propane for for heating and stuff like that because yeah, yeah. I can't the batteries don't store enough power to do that but if you're generating electricity you basically have to use it right away mm -hmm. yeah so I can't generate more than I can use okay so I, I turn it on and then I get I charge the batteries so I get a I get a couple days of, of lights out of it lights and refrigeration oh man that's uh that's pretty amazing i kind of feel stupid now just buying star wars figures uh, <laughs> but i mean i know you were trying to get off the grid but isn't there a ways around it no 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 it's too dangerous i mean look at me i'm wearing a i'm wearing a skirt what, what's the skirt for satellite imagery satellite imagery? mother computer she has access to satellites so if there's something flying over yeah. and she can identify me by the way i walk Right. By the by, the shape of my body, this throws her off. And so she, she it thinks that she assumes that like she will because she's doing image analysis. There's too much to do individually, even for a major computer. So she's doing this major image analysis. You think that she's actually trying to look for you right now? I mean, I, w I mean, what what is what? Is, I don't. I have no idea what she's up to right now. Yeah. I got it. I got it in Japan by the skin of my teeth. Yeah. And I guess we'll never really know why she did that. No idea. Be nice to get home though. So she doesn't scan for, for gender, properly. No, it's a, it's a, it's something I realized a few years ago, huh. um, and I, I'm sorry I didn't mention it because I knew if I did it on the air she'd figure it out. Right. Well. But it's 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 one of the ways of fooling her image her, her image recognition. Right. Um, she'd still get you if you walk past a, a, a CCTV camera or something because she could do facial recognition. Okay. But from a satellite because it's coming from overhead, mm -hmm. she's doing an analysis of like your body shape sure okay and something like this which yeah. makes your hips look wider right throws her off mm -hmm. so it she very, might she might get an initial hit but it won't flag because of the different shape a different shape so actually mm -hmm. when i go outside i wear this and a poncho <laughs> really yeah because it does the double thing mm -hmm. wow. so it's partly a gender thing but it's mostly a shape thing and i noticed that you started shaving your legs again <laughs> 
Dude, I barely shave my face anymore. <laughs> How many rooms do you have in this place? Uh, what is it? Uh, three bedrooms. Wow. Three bedrooms and then two rooms in this half house. Uh, and then this it's really downstairs. Nice. It's quite big. If you uh, if you don't mind leaving me the keys before <laughs> <I go. laughs> um, I could probably uh, probably surprise Eleni with a nice little. Uh, you might surprise her more than you think because uh, yeah. if the I normal. If I find it again, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the normal tenants here are a bunch of a bunch of swingers. So. Oh, are they? Yeah. yeah. So I don't know if you want to show up while they're here. Yeah. They oh. don't. They don't do anything in the winter. It's their off season. Oh yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. No. Um, this is uh, definitely a trek to get here, Paul. Well, yeah, you came in my foot. What was up with that? Yeah, it's. Uh, I sort of got dropped. The wolves didn't bother you, did they? No, no. Uh, that kind of freaked me out, though. How did they know to when you veer they, off the path? They don't like you to go off the road. Yeah, that's. Uh, they that's just pretty crazy. They just don't like that. <laughs> but honestly, their bark is worse than their bite. Is it? Yeah. Yeah, it's really it's a really bad bark though, so you still don't want to get bitten by them. Yeah. Do you have a lot of security set up around the house? Uh, n n no, not I don't want to reveal the location much. because, you know, obviously I don't want people to Well, might here. need to use it again at some point. Yeah, so. But, uh, no, a little bit of a little bit of security. Yeah, well, that's good. A couple of alarm and systems. I Oh, I'm glad you, I, I'm glad you didn't come to the, 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 the front door. Oh, yeah? Because I was thinking about it. I got a, I, I, um, that one, that you don't want to do that. No? That's, that's dangerous. Okay. Um, what is it exactly? Illegal leg hold trap, um, <laughs> sort of uh, a spike spring, that kind of thing. You just yeah. If I had a, if I had a shotgun, I'd have rigged it, but I don't have one. Right, you just the talking one. Just yeah, shut up. You kind of caught me by surprise. I don't have a lot of visitors. <laughs> this uh, this area of the city that you're in, mm. very large uh, Mennonite community. Yeah. They never uh, they never experienced any buzzing noises. <laughs> If they did, it was probably a bumblebee. A bumblebee in their, uh, in a jar. In a jar. That's <laughs> that entertainment for the Mennonites. Yeah, they just shake mm -hmm. it around. Yeah. Look, Isaac, I shaketh the bumblebee. Actually, it's, those are Quakers who talk like that. Oh right. Um, was it? Were they Quakers in uh, that that really bad bowling movie with uh, Bill Murray? I think so. Yeah. They were Quakers in that. Were they Quakers or Amish? I can't remember. I think they were oh, Quakers. They were, yeah. I think I think America just seems to throw everybody in the Amish, uh, yeah, in the Amish uh, basket. Like if 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 they're not using technology, then they must be Amish. That's true. Yeah, that seems to be the case. So you really didn't recognize me without my glasses, my old glasses. Yeah, it, it, it was just, just a sudden and I dark and yeah. Yeah. Your face, basically. I don't remember your face. I just remember the shape of your glasses. Well, I mentioned on the very last podcast that I talked to you. That uh, that I bought a new pair. Well, I oh. had that pair, and these ones have replaced those ones. That's right. You mentioned that to me. I wonder why I did remember that. Maybe it was the beating that I received, the one week in detention, the having to escape custody and deportation and ending up in a log cabin. Maybe that's why I forgot about your friggin' new glasses. Uh, I think uh, I think that might be it. That might be it, yeah. So, I was being sarcastic, by the way. Oh, how long have we known each other? <laughs> <laughs> Too so, long. Yeah. So, anyway, well, I'm glad that you're still alive, and I'm glad you're uh, you've healed up from your beating. Yeah. Well, they 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 do it. They're sneaky, right? They yeah. ribs, and they when they do the face, you can't see. when they do the face, yeah, phone books. Phone books in there. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wouldn't that still bruise though? Like in a large area. Yeah, but they go away faster if it's oh, do they? in a larger like there's so a, there's they still a, hurt. Oh yeah. They just don't leave a mark. Yeah. Okay. You're still you're still transmitting kinetic force to a wider area, mm -hmm. and it's still uncomfortable. I just lucky. I guess I was just lucky I didn't get waterboarded with everything else yeah. that was going on. I wonder if the the mafia, or like organizations, criminal organizations, or the Japanese police department, mm. actually pay yellow pages to exist still since they're yeah because so that's pretty much all they're yeah. it's for old people and for delivering beatings right. That that's that's maybe ninety percent of their uh, their profits come from uh, from those departments, so that they can use uh, to uh, the yellow pages to no, influence. The yellow pages say. don't they don't have profits. That's is it all yellow well, pages? Pay, it's ads, advertising. Then? Well, advertisements. That's what I meant. I mean, they don't they don't you don't pay for the yellow pages. 
No, you don't pay for it, but I mean, it is still money that they get from people who want to promote their product or Maybe. Something. I don't know how it works in Japan. In Yokohama, it's seriously, population more than Toronto, and the, the yellow page is only about this thick. Oh, yeah? The phone book's only, like, we get, get it's basically yellow pages. It's only, like... The entire country is the population of Toronto? Yokohama is the po- is more than the population of Toronto, and her yellow pages is thinner than Kitchener's. Oh, I see. Okay. Wow. So is that a lot of people, or is that not a lot of people? More than Toronto? Well, yeah. given that Toronto's the biggest city in Canada, I'd say. And that and their Yellow Pages is like, you know, yeah. the Tor- last time I saw it, the Toronto Yellow Pages. Is Toronto the biggest? Thing. In Canada? Yeah. Where, what else would be the biggest are city? You, are you saying GTA, or just the city of Toronto? I'd, I think both probably qualify. I don't yeah. know. If you compare them on par, right? If you compare the, the, city, the, the city core mm-hmm. with, like, the megacity right. with... <laughs> with the equivalents in other cities mm-hmm. or if you compare the gta with the equivalents in other cities i'm yeah. pretty sure toronto's the biggest i think i have a little megacity ha <laughs> ha stomach it's probably the t yeah i did poison it slightly so that in case you weren't who you said you were <laughs> i'm okay now oh good good yeah. i've uh, regenerated that part of my body Oh, how was the Christmas special? Don't tell me what happened. Oh, don't worry. We didn't even shoot it yet. No, the Doctor Who Christmas special. Oh, I should mention that now that, that that's you sort of reminded me. Um, uh, with the Doctor Who special, with the uh, Christmas special, the, the uh, companion is awesome. Oh, good. She's so good. She's better than Amy Pond? I think so. I think she might. She has potential of being a lot better. Oh, that's good. Yeah, I, I liked Amy Pond, but I wasn't really a huge fan of her. I think Donna is still the best one. Donna's the best companion. Donna I like, was interesting. And Martha is a close second for me over Rose, even though Rose has been uh, on Rose, Rose. Yeah. Rose. Yeah. I can't, I can't. I got kind of sick of Rose. Me too. And, and I'm constantly on uh, websites and I was reading all these things where people are posting pictures of Rose saying she's the best one. I don't think so. I don't think that's the case anymore. No, I agree. So I think, uh, I think that she was always great as a as a starter companion but other people have done so much more since her that um that it just it just made it a lot um uh it made it kind of old now for me i can't i can't uh i can't go back and watch them i could go back i know i could go back and watch donna again i can no go problem. back i can go back and watch although i do have a, a slight crush on martha really yeah oh, i got a slight crush on amy pond oh yeah okay which is creepy, given how much younger she is than me. You know, it's really yeah. times when watching the shows when you you realize how old you are. Is like it weird that as you get older you feel creepier? <laughs> maybe even, you know. Well, it was I just like remember a pervert maybe for thinking certain things. No, I've always I've always been a pervert, so it yeah, doesn't yeah. bother no, I know me too you much. Have been, but this is a new experience for me. I'm a little bit different than you. Hmm. And so I, but it, what's what's even stranger is when you're a pervert in front of your your partner and then they play along and then i feel even worse you know oh really that would make me feel better yeah no i just uh i I, that's when i stop and realize oh my god i really have to get i have to like see a psychiatrist or something i think it's human nature to be somewhat perverted especially as you age as a man Mm. for a while there when i was on facebook anything that i would post on there would be Oh, I went to on vacation today. I went, you know, blah, 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 whatever. I did here, check out this post. It's kind of funny. And it was safe. Whereas Twitter for me was the Chris inside my mind. So I would just say anything and think, oh, it's 140 characters. Therefore, I could just say anything I want. Right. And I made that distinction between the two because the certain people that followed me on Twitter were like minded as me, where they knew. You know, I'm kidding here. I'm sort of, you know, uh, I, I could say things that I could get away with that, say, my first cousin in Greece who speaks English and knows me as a different person, you know, not this like pervert. Right. I'm, did you use that's right when you like so when you like basically an admission that you're not attracted to sheep might upset your first cousin. <laughs> yes, in exactly. Greece. Yeah. Mm. I, I like monkeys more. She, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna hate me for that. Yeah. She's like, he lied to me. <laughs> he, he, li- said, he, he says, says he, he likes sheep. He says he likes sheep. So I got him a sheep. <laughs> <laughs> There's too many people on Facebook. That's the problem. There's too many people who know different me's. I had to be so careful when I post on Facebook. Mm-hmm. 
that's why I like Google Plus. It's much more control over who sees what, and it's oh, yeah, easier totally. to control. And oh, while you uh, were away, I uh, I actually got to try out the new MySpace. Oh, did you? Yeah. Uh, yet you still have your eyes. Oh, is that why you got new glasses? <laughs> yes. Actually, the uh, the glasses that I bought, the new ones, exploded in my face when I, <laughs> when I actually went onto the site. Um, I, I think I've visited it twice, and uh, yeah, it's not going to work, Justin Timberlake. Sorry. He tried. He tried. Yeah. So, anyway, speaking of uh, exploding faces, um, I have to go use the washroom. Do you have one here? There is an outhouse right outside that that main door. You have to disarm the booby trap. Okay. Okay. It's just the red switch. All right. And um, and then it's you go go out five mm-hmm. steps. Yeah. Turn right, and you'll see the outhouse. All and right. go straight in there. Otherwise, the wolves will get you. The wolves. All right. The wolves. The bad wolf. Yeah. Ha, ha, ha. All right. So uh, maybe we should just sign off. Yeah. Okay. So. Um, yeah. Uh, good luck. Good luck. And what was it? what's what do I say? And um, live long and prosper. Peace out. P- peace. Peace out. No. Peace out and... I'm going to peace out soon. Okay. Please oh. please hurry up. Okay, get out of here. All right, and uh, I'll see you. You and you online. Bye. Toodles. <laughs>